Hello. Let's talk about the chain rule now. It's one of the very important rules in uh, calculus. So the chain rule is used to differentiate uh, composite functions, such as this one uh, represented here, f is g composed to h. So the chain rule states that for two given functions, g of x and h of x, that are differentiable, the derivative of composite function f of x, which is g of h of x, is the derivative of g of h of x times the derivative of h of x. So first we derivate the function and then uh, we derivate the argument of that function. Now in Leibniz notation we're going to use y to denote f of u and u to denote g of x. Again being the two differentiable functions then the final result dy dx is going to be a product of dy du times du dx. It might look uh, a little confusing for now but you'll see it's actually very uh, it's very fun to work with uh, as soon as you get a hang of it. While we are talking about chain rule let's uh, introduce another rule that's going to help us um, calculate a little more complex functions. If you have y equals to u at power n u being uh, another function in regards to x then we can say the derivative d dx of u at power n is going to be we apply the same rule the power rule that we know so it's going to be n u at power n minus 1 but because it's not just x there instead it's a function we have to multiply by the derivative of that function so du dx we can also use the um, notation with uh, g of x directly I mean this decomposition may help you or may hinder you so you may want to reconsider uh, using it directly with d dx of g of x at power n equals to n times g of x at power n minus 1 times the derivative of g of x with this let's conclude this lesson as well and continue with one more rule in the next lesson